The raw emotions over the tragic death of Kobe Bryant, his daughter Gianna, and seven others in a helicopter crash Sunday have spread throughout the world, including the tiny town of Kashmir, Washington. As the Bulldogs stepped back onto the basketball court last night, the community that welcomed the Bryants just two weekends ago paid tribute to those who perished in a letter by the one who knew them, Haley Van Lith. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Haley Van Lith and her family, I'd like to take the time to share with you this passage composed by Haley. To my mentor and friend, Kobe, I am deeply sad that our time has been cut short. God's timing is perfect, and he intentionally brought us together for this long. Thank you for teaching me that it is okay to be unapologetically great. May I honor your legacy by living my life how you, you would have wanted, with intense passion and to fearlessly pursue my craziest dreams. To my little mamas, Gigi, Alyssa, Peyton, I will miss our big sis slash little sis conversations. You can trust I will, I will work tirelessly to elevate girls basketball into everything you three dreamt it should be. Thank you for inspiring my soul. Until next, next time, my dear friends, rest in heaven. At this time, we would like to have a 24 second moment of silence in memory of Kobe Bryant, Gianna Bryant, Alyssa Altobelli, Carrie Altobelli, John Altobelli, Peyton Chester, Sarah Chester, Ara Zobayan, and Christina Mauser. But then somehow they played basketball, just as Kobe and Gianna would have wanted. Kashmir came out tight and seemed to have their minds on anything other than basketball. The Bulldogs trailed at the end of the first quarter for the first time all season. But then with the rip of the twine of a Grace Hammond three, Kashmir was off and running and playing behind the one who's been their inspiration for four seasons, Haley Van Leth. She led a charge that put the Pioneers out of reach holding Omak to three points in the second quarter and nothing in the third. The cashmere we all know was back. The Bulldogs went on to win by 42 points and claim yet another regular season Caribou Trail League championship. Haley finished with a game-high 29 points, just the way Kobe and Gianna would have wanted it. In Cashmere, I'm Eric Grandstrom on the NCW Life Channel.